Hello everyone, how are you? Welcome back to my channel. Um, today this is just a quick video. So why I want to make a quick video? Just because um, I just received a parcel from um, Well People. Well People is a natural brand. Their products uh, has a very good rating um, on Think Dirty. Lots of products um, have been rated uh, zero, which means it's the cleanest uh, product. So, um, but Well People, they don't ship internationally, I think. They just ship to um, America and Canada. That's why I didn't have a chance to try even though I've been um, watching um, their pictures from Instagram and um, and I've seen um, the other YouTubers, they are doing um, their product uh, demonstration um, because um, I'm in New Zealand and it is kind of like very difficult sometimes to get um, those um, uh, American products. Actually, New Zealand Post Office, they have a service uh, which they can give us a, a American address um, so for us to be able to uh, buy um, those products uh, from USA and UK and send it to a particular address and they will uh, send it uh, back to New Zealand uh, to us uh, for a very uh, affordable uh, shipping rate. So I've tried it the first time and I'm like kind of very happy. If you are living in New Zealand, you can go to NZ Post website and choose uh, U Shop, and then you can see what is this surface is. This is my first time to use this surface and I'm very happy about it. So because this is the first time I order from America directly, so I just bought a um, few pieces, not even a few pieces, let me see. Oh. Uh, they even put it in this kind of nice tissue paper with well people printed on it. Actually, I just bought four pieces of uh, their products and among them, one, uh, one item is just a sample, uh, sample product. So let me say I placed the order on um, 14 of October. Today is so it's about like two weeks ago. So it just takes approximately a little bit more than two weeks time uh, from um, to ship the item from uh, USA to New Zealand. I just pay uh, twelve dollar fifty cents New Zealand dollars uh, for the shipping cost. Um, I reckon it's really really good. Um, so uh, what I bought this time, um, let me quickly show that to you. Firstly, I bought their famous uh, foundation stick. Uh, this is an organic uh, product. There is a certified organic uh, logo on the packaging. So um, do they have a barcode? Yeah, let me let me try see if um, Fin Dirty, they have um, they have their uh, barcode in their uh, system or not. Um, I just turned the uh, Think Dirty app on and then I just put it. Whoa. So this foundation stack is rated uh, 3 uh, on Think Dirty um, and most of the ingredients are green color which is a good sign. So I'm so happy. I mean of course, I want a uh, rate zero uh, products, but sometimes in reality, it's hard to get. So three is uh, quite a good number that I can accept. The color I bought is um, it's not the lightest, um, but it is still a quite a light color. I think it is called uh, Fair Gold. So let me open it, see how it looks like. It is just looks like that. Um, no fingerprints. Good side. Let me just test the color. Oh, put it here. Then. Can you see that? <laughs> it's hard to see. Put it. Let me test it. Can you see that? It is quite light and close to my skin color. Actually, oh, I'm quite happy. So let me put it on my face, see how it goes. I actually don't know how to put it on yet, like whether to use a sponge or use a um, brush, but I'll just use my finger first. Okay. 
I don't even know that's the way of putting it on or not. Um, oh, it is quite powdery, I think. I will go online to see how, what's the proper way of putting it on. Like it is quite um, powdery, but um, when I put it on, I feel nothing. It is very light. The feeling is quite good. Um, yeah, I think it is pretty okay to use the finger, to be honest. Like, I do see white, right? Yeah, you can see from the camera, I can see from the camera. Now my face is pretty white. It is, is that too white for me? I don't know. The coverage is quite good though. I mean, I've got lots of black marks here and it lighters now. Yeah. Yeah. Median coverage is good. Oh, I like it. Really like it. Because it's so convenient. Like you just go to the toilet and quickly put it on if you want some makeup and put it in your handbag. And it is so light. I can't find, I can't feel anything on my face. Yeah. How do you think? It is quite light. It is really light. So I can't really find anything. And it's not cakey. Like say, when I smile, it didn't really make my lines show. Obviously, it's not like previously when I used um, uh, 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 liquid foundation and a uh, uh, powder foundation. Um, and then, uh, I mean, at the, when I just finished the makeup, uh, I can easily see that um, the, the, the expression lies so obvious. But this one, yeah, it didn't really make my lines um, more obvious. Oh, that's a good sign. And it is really light. I think I might not even need the um, powder, loose powder to uh, set the um, foundation. Okay, first product, happy. But I just want to see how how long is this stick? What if I move up and cannot move it back? Oh, I better not. <laughs> I better not do it. Okay, happy and it is in a tube. It's so easy to just put it in a handbag. Okay, and I forgot to say, um, this foundation stick is $23.19 US dollar. So very affordable for this kind of uh, clean brand product. The second product is this one. This is a mini size um, uh, concealer. I think it is called by all correct multi action concealer. And I bought this one is number two, which is uh, uh, called light color. So it is not the lightest color. Uh, there is another one called pale or something. This this is the second uh, lightest color. So um, because I don't know their color and then I don't use much concealer. So that's why I try, I bought a, a mini size to try first. So this is really, really tiny. Um, I think it's only like about four mil or something. Um, and then it cost me $9.59. So US dollars. So it's about $10 US. So let me try. Quite mini. Okay. Oh. 
it looks like that. You can see it. Let me put it under my eye. Even that little bit, well, it's, it's more than enough for me. You see, can you see that? It's a lot. You don't need that much though. You just need a little, little bit. Okay. I'm going to get a sponge. I can't just do finger for this one. Okay, don't put that much like me. I think you just need a little bit. Oh, the color really uh, matches my color, matches, matches my skin. Oh, I picked the right color, I think. Yeah. Oh, that's good. Oh, I like it. That's really good. I like it as well. Second product, hey, I like it very much. Okay, and the next one is this one. This is just a sample size. So because um, I bought this is same as this, this is same as this foundation stick, but this is um, the darker color. And this one, uh, I mean not the darker, but darker than this one. This is a, a fair golden. I think yeah, just now I said fair golden. And this one is the lightest one. I think it's color zero called pale ivory. So um, I just want to see because. When I bought this foundation stay, I don't know which color that I should choose because after that there's another one with pink color. I don't like any foundation with pink base inside. So um, I didn't choose that one. So um, this one is the lightest color, I think. So that's why I bought a, a sample size to try the color. So this uh, sample only cost me uh, $1.20 US. So if you're not sure, you actually can try a little bit more color um, uh, and to make sure which color suit you best. So um, this is just now is the uh, light golden that I'm using. So I'm putting on top. Ah. Yeah. Oh, this is really white. I think for the very pale skin, if you can see, okay, this is my uh, light golden that I'm putting on my face just now. And this is the uh, pale ivory, the lightest color. So um, if you can see, it is really, really light. Let me, let, let, let me put it on my face to see how it goes because... Mm. Yeah, I think the pale ivory is a bit too light for me. So uh, for me, my color tone, I think this uh, light golden quite suit me. Like, yeah, I quite like it. Maybe I can go a little bit darker actually. But when I put the uh, brush on, it will go a little bit darker. So I think light golden is quite like my color. Okay, and the last powder is this one. Um, this is a uh, eyeliner. So let me do a thing dirty scan. See what's the rating. Oh, they don't have this product in their system in thing dirty's uh, uh, um, database. So anyway. So um, yeah, because I always want to find a liquid eyeliner, but most of the liquid eyeliner, they have some ingredients. I don't know about this one as it is not in um, Think Dirty's uh, uh, database, but hopefully it is clean because most of their products are clean. So I will just put a hope on that, that this is another good product as well. Oh, <laughs> my goodness. <laughs> Okay, how do you think when you think of that? You thought it's a standard size um, um, eyeliner, right? Oh, when I, when I just open it, 
Tanda! It is that short! Oh, packaging, packaging, anything at the other side? Nah, that's not a good way of doing it, to be honest. I mean, if it's this size, you should just do you should just do that size, okay? Do not do such a long. I mean, it's all about the, how to say, the image and your, the, not the honesty, I wouldn't say the honesty, but it's not necessary to do this kind of packaging to my point of view, I reckon, if the original product is just that little piece. I'm not going to put it on my eyes because I need some practicing. But let me put it on my hair. Ooh. See? Oh, it's, the color is so easy to come out. Oh, that's nice. See? Okay, let me practice at home. Kind of excited of using that. The only thing is like, it's short. It's too short. I mean, I don't expect like a lot, but if you use this packaging, you should either do it longer and put less inside or you just do a shorter packaging and to save more this paper cost, I reckon. So, um, anyway. <laughs> and this one is not expensive. Um, it is $14.39. And this is black color and they only have uh, one color on their website so only the black color so okay that's all for this unboxing because i'm very excited i just got it in the afternoon and i think i will try a few more of their products um, i'm quite interested in uh, some of their other products since uh, this first time um, direct shipping from USA is kind of like successful to me. Um, I think I will try more um, products in uh, North America because they seems like they have more choices than um, New Zealand. So and if you are living in New Zealand and uh, you can go to uh, NZ Post website and check it out um, just uh, they have a name called U Shop, so you just go and check under U Shop, and they will tell you what to do, how to set up the account, um, uh, how the shipping costs calculate. So it is very easy and simple to understand. Or if you are living in New Zealand and you have these uh, more questions about U Shop, you can um, let me know. Um, so okay, this is all for this um, um, video. I hope you will like it. Uh, if you like it, please thumbs up and subscribe my channel. Oh, by the way, also, I actually have an Instagram account. I will put the name here or here. Uh, please also follow me on Instagram. Okay, that's all for this video. I will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.